hormone replacement therapy, we usually think about menopausal women, but men actually go through their own menopause as well. It's called andropause, and Dr. Steve Jepson is here with symptoms and also treatment options. We're talking the other side of the coin today. I'd never heard of this. How common is it? Oh, it's really common. I think most men probably go through it to some degree, just like every woman goes through menopause. But, you know, as we know, women tend to be more vocal about their symptoms and their health concerns. And, He's saying and that with a smile. I, we, we just know that. <laughs> And men tend to kind of be quieter about those things, and I, and I think that consequently they tend to seek out care a little bit less for this. But women are more symptomatic. Women have, you know, dramatic hot flashes. Sometimes they can have dramatic mood changes. Men don't get the drama, but they still can get subtle symptoms that can affect their quality of life. And I think that it's still something important to identify because we can help men feel better. Um, fairly significantly. So, so let's talk those symptoms. Are they comparable at all to the symptoms women experience you know, or are they completely different? Th th they're, they're somewhat different. I, there's mood symptoms for both men and women and I think that a man's mood symptoms through andropause are just kind of a lower mood, um, kind of sometimes a mild depression, but a lot of a lot of irritability. I think that's what women mention to me about their husbands is my husband's getting a lot more irritable. I, you know, can you fix it? And the answer is, well, if it's due to andropause, yes, we can. And certain age ranges, are there a specific age range where you usually You know, kind of the same age. You know, it's kind of late 40s through the 50s are more common, but it's something that can kind of start to develop in the 60s or it can start to, to start as early as 40. And, you know, irritability is not the only symptom. I think look, fatigue is a really common symptom. Um, foggy thinking, um, insomnia. A lot of men will blame this on stress or on the demands of their job or on the demands of life life we're just mm -hmm. on getting older and I think a lot of them need to start realizing you know what maybe it is a hormonal change maybe it it is due to getting older but it's a hormonal getting older that can be identified and fixed and so before you do blame it on the scenarios you just mentioned the getting older right. uh, there's a test you can actually perform and conduct to determine where the hormone levels are absolutely at. so the problem in men is low testosterone women go through menopause when their estrogen drops men go through through andropause when their testosterone drops a lot of other hormonal changes can take place associated with andropause as well so we can test and, and we want to test and the way that we test at our office is I always do saliva testing because I, I think that saliva testing is far more accurate than blood I think that blood testing can can identify some of the more severe um, instances of andropause but saliva is always going to get catch all the instances um, and that's one of the ways we test and I think we showed a little, little video of that here in a and, second. And once you have those results what are the options what are the solutions with the treatment available? So solutions are shots and that's one of the more common way a lot of men out there are getting testosterone shots right now but the way that I prefer is just with the testosterone cream or a testosterone gel there's a commercially available testosterone gel I prefer to have a local compounding pharmacy put the testosterone together in a cream and then the man applies the cream just onto the arm or onto the back once a day. I think that gives much steadier levels than the ups and downs that can be associated with the shots. If women at home are relating, they're saying my husband might fit into this category, they can call you with questions. They can call, we can help. But you know, men can feel better, their moods can be better, they can sleep better, um, they can just feel better. And it's just a matter of identifying this andropause and if it's indeed the case, we can fix it. A simple test, and that can be done, of course, if you contact Dr. Jepson's office. Information on the screen and available on the Studio 5 website as well. Interesting topic, Steve. Thanks so much. Welcome. Coming up on...